Hey there, I'm Rob McDonald, and I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about ways you can actually get more out of Corel Painter Essentials 4. And the way you do that is actually through a device, and that device is called a Wacom Pen Tablet. Uh, here I have the Wacom Bamboo Tablet, um, and what I'm doing is I'm using it um, instead of a mouse, although you do see I have a mouse. So the tablet actually comes with a mouse, and it also comes with a pen. And both of these devices work um, slightly different. So let's go in and I'm just going to show you how you would use a mouse. So, well, I think you already know how to use a mouse, but I think you get my point. So I'm going to do a photo painting, and let's select a picture, and we'll click open on that. And for this component of Painter Essentials, um, I'm just going to use a mouse. I don't need the pen for this. So what I'm going to do is select an oil painting and click Start. And that's going to go ahead and paint. So at this point, I don't really need to leverage um, a lot of the technology that's in the tablet, but there is some that, I'm going to, that, I'm, that we're going to talk about here in a couple seconds. So that's gone through. It's painting. And once it stops, I can use other brushes. So the brush here, I'm going to just kind of click with the mouse, and you'll see that the detail is actually starting to come back in the image. Now, one of the things with, with painting with a mouse is that it's kind of like painting with a bar of soap. Um, it's either full on or full off. And that's kind of where the pen comes into play. Because the tablet recognizes different pressure points, I can leverage the pressure sensitivity to either apply a little bit of paint or a lot of paint. And the easiest way to show that is on the drawing and painting side of things. Let's do that and let's do a new canvas. And the really the, the best way for me to illustrate this to you is by using one of our dry media. And what we'll do is we'll select uh, square chalk. And let's select a color, let's select red. And when I make a brush stroke, you can see that I'm getting uh, a very little bit of chalk on the canvas, and you can see that texture coming through. Or when I push harder, I get a lot. So I can vary the pressure sensitivity within Painter Essentials to give me a very, very, very realistic painting experience. And that's done through the use of a tablet. Now you're probably thinking to yourself, well, can I use a tablet for anything else? Absolutely. It works just like a mouse. Uh, the, the area here um, is actually mapped to your screen. So all I have to do is actually point to where I want to go on my screen, and the cursor will follow me along. It's great for repetitive stress. So if anybody's using a mouse a lot on a daily basis and they find their arms getting a little tired, the pen-based tablet is the absolute best way to go. Um, I don't even really use a mouse anymore personally. Everything is done with the, uh, with the pen-based tablet. There are a number of different of, uh, of flavors of tablet. Um, this is the Bamboo Fun. This is the newest uh, uh, pen tablet from Wacom. There's a, two other versions. There's an Intuos line and a Cintiq line. Um, I'd recommend going out and having a look at the different options that are available, but I do really recommend um, certainly the Wacom brand tablet. So again, uh, with the tablet, you're able to leverage uh, different pressure sensitivities, and it gives you a much, much more natural painting experience than just using a mouse alone.